Hey, good day, everybody. This is Sports Fanatic News. I'm Joe Boric, and unfortunately, the USA women's team fell 3-2, to two, but in a great battle to Team Canada. As obviously, for the reasons of this channel being unbiased, I have to first and foremost give props and congratulations to Team Canada and Marie-Philippe Poulin for continuing her ridiculous streak um, throughout the entire tournament of by far being one of the most dominating um Figures in the entire tournament from the jump, Team Canada's captain. But so hats off to Canada, congratulations to Canada and the great fans like Pierre Wisdom that does stuff for Steel Flyers as well as Payton on the radio and everybody else that's celebrating up there in Canada for reclaiming the gold from Team USA. You guys did deserve it. You brought the spunk, you brought the in, you went up 3 0. Um, bringing a lot early. Team USA then battled back. These were clearly the two best teams in the 20. Finland then wins their second straight bronze. Uh, so it wasn't all too surprising, obviously, that uh, this became the gold medal game, where in contrast for the men's, like I said yesterday, the women's got bragging rights no matter what for both countries. Both countries got out in the quarterfinals, one to Sweden, one to Slovakia. So when it came to this game, Canada really, again, they jumped the ante early. Uh, Des Beans also, uh, she was fantastic um, in net yet again. Uh, she's continued to just be immaculate um, in net for Team Canada, and she made some key saves late in the second and also early in the third that could have changed the tide of the game because, of course, uh, Hillary Knight was able to score a shorthanded goal in this game for Team USA. So imagine if then... <laughs> Uh, early in the third period, Team USA, rather than getting a goal way late in the third at the end by Amanda Kessel, Phil Kessel's sister, they would have had a different game if one of those was able to squeak in. So Desbings, um played a absolutely immaculate game. Uh, Cavallini also, she didn't play bad in my opinion. I thought she played solid. I just thought Team USA left too many open high percentage chances to Team Canada, who, like I said, has been scoring like an Armageddon army just coming right at you this entire tournament. That's why I gave them the favorites coming in, and it ended up playing out as much as I hated to do it, because I'm a, I'm from USA. I'm a USA fan. I, I'm born and raised in the Philadelphia area. You have to give credit where credit is due, and they were the favorites coming in. They're the team that ended up winning the game, rightfully so. Marie-Philippe pull in. Um, continued to be the best in the tournament. Amanda Cassell, though, continued to excel and play great uh, herself in the tournament. And Team USA battled to the end. That's what I love to see. Uh, Sarah Fillier played well again. <clears throat> so did, uh, speaking of the Sarah, Sarah Nurse. Uh, she was fantastic in this game, having that good setup play to Marie-Philippe pull in. Oh, again, you can tell how, with this channel, I love to try to be as unbiased as possible. I'm getting <laughs> because... I'm not even a Canada fan, I'm talking about how great you guys played, because you did, and you deserve the praise. Um, when it comes to USA, uh, I thought they battled great. Hillary Knight played a good overall game. Uh, Schofield had a couple chances. She was just stopped by Des uh, from Debian's. Uh, and then you have uh, Harmon played solid. Rogue had a couple good chances as well. She was just stopped by the hot netminder. And then so was Carpenter in a couple plays. This was just one of those games... Um, De Debians, um, or Desbians, however you say her name, Debians, I usually mispronounce her names, but she's been absolutely money the entire tournament in net. Again, I'm new to women's hockey, so sorry for mispronunciations and stuff like that, but like, she was money, she was the best goalie in the tournament, Cavallini was probably the second best, so it makes sense, and the teams are absolutely loaded. Uh, I talked about that in other videos, if you want to check out the Women's Olympic Hockey playlist, you can see how I've talked about how stacked these teams were in other videos, but I thank you all for checking out the coverage of the Olympics as I covered the Women's Olympics, I'm going to keep doing it with the men's, that's in the Men's Olympic Hockey players, if you want to check those out until those games wrap up at the end of uh, the weekend, but everybody have a great day, this has been a reaction to Team Canada beating Team USA. Congratulations for reclaiming the gold from Team USA, ca Team Canada, as Marie-Philippe Poulin, Debians, uh, LaRoche, Fast, uh, Nurse, Jenner, Sarah Fillier, and everybody leads you guys to gold. And then for Team USA, Silver is obviously a very good solace. It's tough, um, but it's nice to still get second best medal, the silver medal, and walk away with that. Um, 
compared to nothing, which is obviously what the men's circuit did. It was a tough to watch this loss. They battled to the end. Debian's made great saves for Team Canada. Otherwise, I think this could have been a game that easily went to OT. So I would have to say grade-wise to wrap up this video, you have to give Canada an A+. Plus. Obviously, they won the tournament. They played great. But Team USA is in the A category as well because they played amazing. They battled back to the end, and Debian's just made great saves. Otherwise, I think this game could have been an overtime game. But credit to Team Canada, Marie-Philippe Fulman, uh, pull in. Sarah Nurse uh, and uh, Sarah Philly are doing great in her first tournament, and et cetera, et cetera. Great game. Great gold medal game. <clears throat> great battle to the end. That's really what you want to see in the gold medal game. Congratulations, Team Canada. Peace out, everybody. Stay safe. And to subscribe down below or up above on the easy-to-use widget to keep the channel growing to 200 by the end of February. Really appreciate all you guys' love and support and following the coverage of the Women's Olympics. If you want to check out all the past videos, again, please check out the Women Olympic Hockey Playlist. Peace out, everybody, and stay safe.